Hey everyone, welcome back to the Magic World. Today we're creating a fork to go along with the spoon and plate we created in the last two videos. That spoon is so long. Um, let's see, let's make this pretty thin. This one's kind of made a bit differently than the last two. So let's make seven here. And we need some here. Okay, that should be enough. Let's, um, select those. We made it seven so we can get it like that. Let's create it like that, and then go into the top view here, and take these vertexes, and maybe, maybe could we do it for that one? Yeah, okay. And a bit smaller. Okay. Also, I want it to be a bit longer. And maybe add some little spice. Let's, let's get those edges right here. But definitely we want um, to get these edges. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. And we also want to put an edge loop between those. So I don't think I can put one there. No, no, it will not go through all of those. Okay, and then let's also all these selected. And push these down a bit. This is a very odd looking fork now that I'm really looking at it. I think this should be taller, not deeper. And then we can have... Um, do that and I think that's pretty good so let's go to mesh and then smooth so we can actually smooth this and you know it's a small fork it's a small guy um, don't worry about that right there probably won't be affected when you do it I don't know what happened with mine there let's add um, black to this um, and add it to our plate, and then in my next video, I'll make a, a table, okay, I think that's pretty, it's not on the, resting on the plate, is what I meant to say, okay, there, that's good enough. So yeah, thanks for watching, and please subscribe, and I'll make the table video next.